Tonight, more steps by the Jacksonville Fire and Rescue Department to make the city safer. A third critical care rescue unit is now in place. It's used when people need medical care right away. The first two, one on the west side, the other on the north side, they are said to have saved lives already. News for Jacks reporter Jim Piggott shows this new unit is located in one of the busiest parts of the city, Arlington. For JFRD, this is an exciting event. This is the third critical care unit now here in the Jacksonville area. I'm going to show you why this is important. What you can see is what they have is equipment out here, more than an ambulance, equipment that can save your life. Medication on here that could save your life. That's not in a normal ambulance. The paramedics have been specially trained for this. There are now three of these in Jacksonville. We're going to talk to the doctor in charge of this, the medical director here. I'm going to come out, and I don't want to knock anything over, but we're going to get it. Here we go. Thank you, sir. All right. How important is this to Jacksonville? I think this is just an added layer of uh, patient protection. So, so we have uh, 63 rescue units across the city, but now three of them are critically care trained. This will save people's lives. It will. It will. It will help them get to the hospital when they're suffering from a major medical illness or a major traumatic illness. And this is something that other ambulances can't do. Why? Because of the specialized training that's required. Uh, these medications are very potent, uh, so they have to be uh, administered by people that are trained and understand these medications. The procedures that we do save lives, but they're also complicated and need, require special training as well. So that's why there's only three right now, but hopefully the plan is to continue to grow this program as we continue to see success. And it's one of the few in the country to have this, correct? Correct. I think and that's exciting that's news for Jackson. Very exciting. Thank you, sir. We appreciate that. So what we're going to see, this, as I mentioned, could save your life, and it's something that JFRD is proud of. Jim Pickett, Channel 4, The Local Station.